They say he screams in his sleep, calling out for his father. Abbas, what a miserable man. It is not our place to judge. It certainly is. If our master has gone mad, I would like to know. Shh. Good evening. Water. Of course. Sit. <clears throat> Many thanks. What brings you here, old man? Pity Abbas. Do not mock him. He has lived as an orphan for most of his life, shaped by his family's legacy. He is desperate for power, because he is powerless. He is our mentor. And unlike Al Mualim or Al Tair, he never betrayed us. Nonsense. Al Tair was no traitor. He was driven out, unjustly. Is it? Is it you? I heard the rumors, but I did not believe them. I wonder if I might speak to Abbas myself. It's been a long time. Impossible. Abbas uses rogue Fedayin to keep us from the castle. Fewer than half the fighters here are true assassins. So, where do I begin? With us. You say these men are cruel. Has anyone raised his blade against an innocent? Alas, yes. Brutality seems to be their sole joy. Then they will die. For they have compromised the order. But those who still live by the creed must be spared. You can trust in us. You've heard the stories going around the village. About the boss and his nightmare? No, no. al -Tai. What about? People say an old assassin saved the life of a merchant down in the valley. They say he fought with a hidden blade. Ah, rumors. I don't believe it. True or not, say nothing to our boss. He is sick with us. Altair is here, in the village. Send word to the castle, quickly. Assassins! To me! That man seems familiar. Mentor! Welcome. Shh! We do not want to get him killed. There! Kill the traitors! You are nothing without that Nothing! You pathetic miser! Follow me to the castle. And spill no blood if you can help it.
Altair. <sighs> Two decades have passed since we last saw you within these walls. We could use your wisdom. Now more than ever. For you fools, he has bewitched you. Our mentor has returned. My respect, mentor. For a path. He's headless. I fight for you, for the order. I'll tell you. Come back, man. Your presence honors me. Die! Die. 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 Together for victory, mentor. Welcome mentor. back, mentor. Tell your men to stand down. No! I am defending Mashaf. Would you not do the same? You corrupted everything we stand for and lost everything we gained. All of it sacrificed on the altar of your own spite. And you! You have wasted your life staring into that apple, dreaming of your own glory. That is true, Abbas. I learned many things from the apple, of life and death of the past and the future. Let me show you. I can never forgive you, Altair. The lies you told about my family, my father, the humiliation I suffered. They were not lies, Abbas. I was ten years old when your father came to see me. He was in tears, begging to be forgiven for betraying my family. Then he cut his own throat. I watched his life ebb away at my feet. I will never forget that image. No! But he was not a coward, Abbas. He reclaimed his honor. I hope there is another life after this one. Then... I will see him... and know the truth of his final days. And when it is your time... we will find you. And then... there will be... No doubts. An old man, and still he fought to hold our brotherhood together. I would have called him stubborn in my youth, but now I can only admire his courage. The assassins were his life, from beginning to end. He had no other. Thank <laughs> you. 
Lost in the darkest corners of the sea. How is your brother doing? Word around the city is you're leaving us. It's nothing I do a secret. <laughs> Not to worry, brother. The captain of your ship is a friend. But neither of you are going anywhere just yet. The Janissaries have raised the chain across the mouth of the Halic and ordered a full blockade until you are caught. They raised the chain for me. We will celebrate later. Uh, here. I have something for you. Careful. This has 50 times the kick of our usual bombs. Bene. I know what to do. The suspense is palpable. Yusuf, wait. Un favore. Yes? There is a woman running a bookshop at the old Polo trading post. Sofia. Look out for her. She is a remarkable lady. You have my word. Gather your men. This will attract some attention. Subtle approach. Uh, see, sorry for the delay. Do you regret anything, Desmond? Like what? Running away, leaving your parents behind, finding a shit job and pretending to be productive. What's it like spending your whole life avoiding hard decisions? Come on. Sure, you're an assassin, but it wasn't your choice. 
Do you have a point? I want to know if you regret anything. Sure. I wish I'd been more patient with my parents. I wish I'd listened. And Lucy, maybe things could have been different if I'd... I'm not sure. Thank you. For what? For making sense. Sean, you feeling okay? I have left Constantinople and set sail for the interior of Anatolia, to a region called Cappadocia, where Manuel is training his soldiers. If I am lucky, I will not be alone, for there may be Ottoman spies in the area waiting to strike. But, as ever, I put stock only in myself, and hold the memory of dear Sophia close to my heart. Claudia, you would laugh to hear the racing thoughts of your brother now. I have come to admire Sophia with more affection than I thought possible. After the death of Christina, something withered in me. But that feeling, that capacity for love, has returned. I adore Sophia, but dare not drag her into this life of mine. Not without fear of hurting her, or driving her away. of an army here, and no signs of Tarek's men.
Not so close, Adi Herif. Easy now. Tarek sent me. Only you? Why not more? I am enough. Where are your men? Captured by Byzantines over a week ago. I was dressed to look like a slave and managed to escape. But the others? Are you a capable fighter? I like to think so. Well, when you are certain, come find me. Did you happen to see that we caught another of the Sultan's spies lurking about? A woman this time, disguised as a harlot of low birth. <laughs> Sending his harem girls now, eh? It seems the Sultan is running out of skilled fighters. Where did you take her? Inside. Into the prisons. But she won't last long. Not with Shakulu in charge. <laughs> How soon before my soldiers are trained to use those guns? A few weeks at most. Janissaries will know I have betrayed them by now. But do they have the resources for retribution? Doubtful. The Sultan's battle with Selim commands most of their attention. <laughs> ah! What the hell is that spell? Apologies, Manuel. Some of these Ottoman prisoners are so... fragile. <laughs> Shakuru, try to moderate your anger. I know the Sultan humiliated your people, but there is no need to spit on men who are beneath us. Mm. You, take the woman from the prison and bring her to the chapel. Shakuru, I don't have the key. Find it! Who has the key? You? I think Nicholas has it. He's on leave in the market. Christemu, I'd like to run that man through with a spear. Hey, hey. Talk to yourself, taxi. Oh, for that. Hmm. 
is quite well armed. No. <laughs> <Get it. laughs> Everyone was taken prisoner. Poor men. That Turkman renegade did this. Shakul. I'll kill him! Wait! You do not cooperate very well. I'm here to rescue my men, not make friends. Right there. That armor is too thick for bullets. I will have to get in close. Jonas, we have to help him. Can you walk? Evet. The rifles you brought, they should be destroyed. 
Most of them don't actually work. But the gunpowder is real. We could not fake that. Bene. Keep out of sight until you hear the explosions. Then, you run. Explosions? If you do that, all hell will break loose. You will panic the entire city. See, si. I am counting on it. And then what? Then I find Manuel Palea Logos. I got it! Wow. 
Sabotage manual. You need to take cover. Get out of my way. Citizens, soldiers, compose yourselves. Not give in to fear. We are the true shepherds of Constantinople. We are the lords of this land. We are Byzantines. Morayo, stand fast. Do not let anyone break it. Stop that man! Shut him down! advantage of a poor and displaced people, using us to further your own vain quest. But we fight for dignity, assassin. We fight to restore peace to this troubled land. Templars are always quick to talk of peace, but very slow to concede power. Because power begets peace, Flaka. It cannot happen in reverse. These people would drown without a fell hand to lift them up and keep them in line. There he is. The monster I came to kill. Come! I've just got a reward, you see. I should have been Constantine's successor. He had so many plans. Your dream dies with you, Manuel. Your empire is gone. Huh? But I am not the only one with this vision, assassin. The dream of our order is universal. What am I, Byzantine? These are only labels. Costumes and facades. Beneath these trappings. All Templars are part of the same family. Enough prattling. I am here for the Masyaf key. Then Take it. Take it. And seek your fortune. See if you get within 100 leagues of that library before one of us finishes you off. Poor Manuel. Last of the Paleologi. I should not have put him in charge of our Masyaf expedition. He was an arrogant man. Impossible to keep in line. Disappoint me, Ahmed. 
Why the Templars? Because I am tired of all of these pointless blood feuds that pit father against son, brother against brother. To achieve true peace, mankind must think and move as one body with one mastermind. The secrets in the Grand Temple will give us just that. And Altair will lead us there. Delusions. Altair's secrets are not for you. I am not interested in arguing, Ezio. I am here for the Masyaf Keys. Keys? Are there more than this one? So I have heard. Perhaps I should ask someone who knows better. Sofia Sarto. Is that her name? She knows nothing. Leave her be. We shall see. I will kill you if you touch her. I know you'll try. Come on! Let's get out of here! 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 Let's get out of here!